Hello Zahir, just wanted to go over a skeleton uh, of your website before we proceeded any further and of course you're going to have navigation at the top here uh, there'll probably be registration and login on that side as well an image which will be I guess a food image or your uh, image of your business uh, your logo will go here and this is a Chinese shop we just knocked up something to show you uh, what we would do and you're going to be called uh, whatever your restaurant Desi um, uh, Indian house there uh, delivery if there's a delivery delivery fee but or it could be delivery fee under uh, a certain amount there's a minimum order which I guess you'll want and uh, a maximum order which I guess you won't want um, your opening times each day that you're open from two and then as we go through the the website we're going to have the categories of the food there'll be a menu I'll drop down to that in a second <clears throat> you can or cannot have reviews if you want them and then we have information about your restaurant which would be your location um, and whatever you, you want to say on that and then the order for this order so let's just look over the restaurant information first it would be the overview, your opening hours, your contact details and everything to do with that. Reviews, there's nothing in there but we would just have reviews if we wanted to on that. And then let's just go back to menu now. So <clears throat> people can choose, oh we've got it in dollars. Um, okay that's going to change to, well I guess you're going to have Scottish pounds on there aren't you? Um, certainly if the referendum goes some people's way and you're independent you'll have Scottish pounds on there so we can search for our food we can go down we can pan down or we can choose a category we might want to choose a, a chicken category we might want to, you're not doing pizzas but let's just choose a chicken, chicken category and what we have here is some chicken dishes two pieces of chicken popcorn chicken nuggets I know you're not doing these but um, it's just an example for you so let's say we want a chicken wrap at three pounds click on that and it comes out here we've got a pickup fee which is the um, uh, delivery fee which I'll, I'll talk about that in a second let's have another chicken wrap somebody else wants some so we've got a total in there I want chicken tikka wrap and I want a piece of chicken on its own and I'm really hungry today so I want a pizza as well a chicken tandoori pizza um, in this area here you can um, write whatever you want on here uh, about it and um, uh, then there are pages on the website as well so you can add your pages it's got up a little bit boop, 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 boop. there we go pages here so you can have whatever how it works uh, results um, and you can have blogs uh, as well and uh, other details so your order is picking up now it's $35 um, your subtotal is 16 but you know what we've said that you've got to have a minimum up here of $20 so when I click to confirm order it won't confirm it will say that uh, your minimum order doesn't meet the minimum order so we've got to get some more grub in our package so um, let's have uh, one of those some drinks and uh, yeah I'm going to add that to the menu and um, let's have a look I'm going to have a Red Bull because I need charging up today I know I clicked on, I, I clicked on Tick and Chandori, Tandori but we just made this um, so we could show you how this works and how have we got we got a total um, of 33 so this works on a mobile phone as well so if I draw this right the way over to like mobile phone size you will see that everything works on the mobile and then you'll see right at the bottom will be the uh, be the shopping cart when we get to the bottom we can click on categories and choose categories on the mobile phone as well so let's move back over this way here we go and now we've got enough we're gonna pay card I guess most times people are gonna pay card but they might want to be cash at the door can I confirm the order order details now of course if you haven't got a an account or a reader or order account we can sign up we can invent a username first name last name email click that in the robot create an account or if they have an account already log in with previous account details or 
Even better, they can log in with Facebook, Twitter, and Google+, which is great. If they click on that, they'll automatically sign up uh, to uh, people. So there's my order, and once I've signed up, I'm £82 there. I create my account, I go in, I pay, and I then can go in and add my address and delivery details uh, on your side, on your website side, you can send emails on updates to people on the, the on when their delivery is, is left your your um, place and when it's due for delivery. You can also <coughs> excuse me, and there's a back end for you to control and accept the orders in as well, which is uh, separate to the the front end, which is where the clients go. So give me a call and let's uh, run over this so that I can um, proceed with this a little bit further.